guess who came to visit one week early? Tom. So, I have decided for the first time in my life, I will conquer and defeat Tom. How will I do it? I will not allow him to kill my protocol. So, I am on a mission to be a myth buster. I worked very, very hard. Uh, first round, so of course I'm more excited than most probably uh, that are on second, third, fourth rounds because I'm just here first round. Is, that's the way it is for everyone, most people anyway. So I've just decided that I am not going to, I'm gonna do my best not to gain weight. I'm gonna do my best not to do anything off protocol. And now the thing I am doing that is not a Dr. Simeon's thing is the share talking noodles. I haven't done them every day. I've done, um, I've done them twice and I haven't done them every meal like twice, once for lunch and once for dinner. And um, so they weren't around in Dr. Simeon's day, so I, I wonder how he would feel about those zero, zero, zero everything. And they do um, give your tummy sort of a feeling of fullness. And the thing about it for my husband and I, which has been really nice, and somebody said that, I think it was um, not enough hours, that on days 20 and above you, you do get kind of antsy and we have been kind of antsy my husband more so than myself and um, just wanting to eat different foods wanting to do something different getting tired getting bored of the same old thing so um, ha adding the sheer talking noodles at this point has been a really good thing for us because it's given us something new and we also found the Grassini bread sticks, which we could not find anywhere. And we found them at Safeway. Actually, Safeway makes them, Safeway Select. So that is really exciting and something new for us because we've just been doing Melba toast. And I don't know if you've been following me, but I am one of those people that eats absolutely everything. That does not mean I get all the 500 calories in because, you know, I do my fitness pal and sometimes just like yesterday, I still had 98 calories and I ate all four things. So, um, just like some vegetables are really higher in calories and some are not like spinach. It's unbelievable. So I really like spinach chips. So I make spinach chips a lot. And um, so I am drinking lots of water, drinking lots of tea, and decided that I will not gain on Tom, and I will not cheat on Tom, and I will not let Tom beat me because I am going to beat Tom. And I want to turn over a new leaf that even though I feel like I want to eat junk, even though this time of month makes me want carbs, I am, I've just decided, you know what, this is my new life. This is my new lifestyle. It is time to conquer Tom once and for all. So why not start now? So that's my plan. And that's what I feel like I'm doing because last week I didn't know Tom was coming in. I was suffering. Remember how I was suffering with um, cravings and I didn't realize Tom was going to come five days early when I was, you know, a few days before. I'm usually kind of messed up in the head and want to junk out on everything. And so I didn't, but I had those cravings, those crazy cravings last week. And so then when Tom came on Saturday, I was like, ha ah, ha. There you are, so you're the culprit. Anyway, so my plan is just to move forward. Now I am down, my percentage is down. I was, I had been on this release of over a pound a day. I am not that now. Now I'm like 0.97 or something crazy like that. So my plan is I want to lose release a pound a day and I want to stay on that so I'll tell you I will drink water till that water is coming out of my body if I can so I can get back to that one pound release a day and I believe I can as soon as uh, Tom is out of the house dude you are moving out as soon as he's out I believe I will have some significant releases so anyway but I am not gonna gain you watch I will not gain anyway 
you guys have a good day. Bye.